In this video, let's discuss why Pepe is pumping all the way to the upside. What is really causing Pepe to move upward? Because we want to know why this very move is happening right now in the market. And is this move going to last long? That means are we still going to see the market move upward or we're going to see the market come back down all the way from here? And the reason why Pepe is one of your best meme token for this variable market and Bitcoin price analysis, I still believe market will not go down right there for retracement. Market will still move upward a little bit on Bitcoin before we see that very retracement coming to the market very, very soon. All of this in this very video. So watch this video all the way to the very end. Please consider supporting this channel by leaving a like for this video, subscribe right now, and turn on the bell notification for more crypto videos like this one. Also check the channel for all that crypto content and join our Telegram channel with a link in the description and also in the pinned comment for more crypto updates and investing strategies. If you look at Pepe, it's pumping all the way to the upside. And this pump happened yesterday, okay, which was 13th November 2024. That was on Wednesday yesterday. The market began to pump all the way to the upside. And today, we are also seeing that very pump coming into the market right here. What is the cause of this very pump? We want to know the cause of this very pump. One of the reasons why we are seeing this very pump is because of this very news. You see, breaking Robin Wood has released Soul, ADA, XRP, and also adding Pepe to its platform. Robinhood is one of the biggest trading platforms that we have when it comes to crypto and investing. And right now, if Pepe have been added to the platform, which means Pepe was not there before, okay? Before now, we see Robinhood delist Soul. They also delist ADA and XRP. But this time around, they released Soul, ADA, and XRP and add Pepe. Pepe was not there before now. This is one of the reasons why we are seeing this very aggressive pump all the way to the upside because Robin would have access to a huge number of investors across the United States and also in Europe. And this is very important right now because if Robin would list Pepe on their platform, what you should be doing is buying more pepper into your portfolio if you've not bought already when the market was very very low and this is very important for all of us right now for me one of my biggest meme coin holding for this variable market have been pepper ever since the ending of last year and i am still holding pepper all the way to the upside because i believe the market is going to move all the way to the upside now someone can make a case and said pepper have a very high market capitalization that is fine but for me pepe have not seen any bull market okay this is the first bull market that pepe is going to see and the reason why i am betting hard on pepe right now as well so let's look at the technical aspect of this very chart and look at what we should be paying attention to right now as we await other move in the market look at it here this is the highest high pepe just created a new all-time high yesterday and is still moving upward today creating another new all-time high today and as you can see right here we see this very market consolidation around this very area of important support and then afterward market move all the way to the upside and then we have retracement right here market move upward we have retracement right here and right now market is moving all the way to the upside i believe strongly that this very move that is in right now for pepe is going to lead us into the 0 0.405 and 0 0.407 okay within this zone is where we're going to expect this very movement to land us so still expect this movement to continue all the way to the upside on pepe in the next coming weeks and even though it's not as aggressive as we see yesterday the market is still going to move all the way to the upside and looking at the stochastic rsi indicator which is one of my favorite indicators that i use for trade confirmation if you look at this market is just crossing the 50 percent line which is at this very point this means market have a great capability of moving into the overbought condition at this very point and when market do market can stay as well for some time which mean market have capacity 
of moving upward on price action so this is what you should pay attention to right now on your chart which is very very important another indicator that just signified that this move just started is the MACD indicator look at it here before now when we see previous moves on pepe we see that the MACD was already forming on the positive side of the MACD look at it here market move upward and the retracement continue upward and all of this why market was forming on the positive side of the MACD right here that's when we see all this move to the upside and paper was moving aggressively to the upside to the 0 0.40156 before this declined all the way to the downside that we saw previous weeks and right now market is moving upward again now if you notice on this very chart you discover that this very area was the point where paper was going down okay which is the negative side of the MACD market go all the way to the downside and then begin to have consolidation right here. Right now, market have start formation on the positive side of the MACD again. What do you think is going to happen? Market is going to pump all the way to the upside. Look at it here. Just one bars, which means market have a long way to go for this very move to happen all the way to the upside. And not only that, if you take a look at the MACD line and the signal line right here, they are still on the positive side of the MACD, which also signify that market have high capability of moving all the way to the upside. And that is what you must keep your eye on if you are holding pepper. And also if you are considering holding pepper in your portfolio, this is another thing you must also have to keep your eye on as well. And this is very important for all of us that are trading or holding pepper for a long time right now expect this very market on the one week chart to still move all the way to the upside and like i said i am expecting this move to enter into this very area of 0.405 at this very point up to 0.407 at this very area so within this zone is where i am expected this move to move into okay and this will take weeks okay it's not what we're going to see all, all of a sudden it can happen all of a sudden but i am looking at this happen in weeks looking at the one day chart pepe market move all the way from here upward for an impulsive move what are we expecting on the one day chart is very clear right here that the market still have capacity of moving upward for me i still believe pepe is going to climb upward a little bit even creating a new high this is what i am personally looking at as well on the one day chart so pay attention to market continuing this move upward even though if you look at the stochastic RSI indicator the market is already at over bought condition that does not mean market is just going to move all the way to the downside remember we are already in a bull market and any retracement you see on the chart is an opportunity to buy more for the market to move upward again for the next impulsive move not only that if you look at the macd indicator market is showing great momentum on the macd histogram from this very area right here which means market have capacity of continuing this aggressive momentum from the boost all the way to the upside and this is what you have to keep your eye on as well if you are trading or if you are holding pepe for this variable market if you look at the four hour chart the four hour chart looks very very okay but market is going to retrace just slightly on the four hour chart and then continuation is going to continue in the next coming days i am expecting that a little retracement is going to happen within this very area where the market is right now in this very price level of zero point four zeros two seven nine so from this area market can retrace a little bit just little retracement and the market is going to continue upward together with the one day chart and the one week chart so most importantly don't take a short position on pepe because market cannot just crash all the way to the downside as expected for it to be in profit or good profit if you want to take a short position rather look for buy or long opportunity on this very pair and move the market together with it all the way to the upside this is what you must pay attention to right now the most important thing for this very video is that for robin wood to list pepe on their platform it is a big deal it opened a lot of door to investors 
across the United States and also Europe to invest in Pepe. And the reason why we are seeing this very aggressive pump all the way to the upside. BTC USDT one day chart. Look at it here. Market is still going to move upward. That is what I am expecting. A little move upward, maybe a possible creation of a new high. And then market is going to retrace a little bit. Now, when I talk about retracement in the bull market, retracement is very, very um, hard to trade. That means don't take a short position with the hope that market is going to come all the way to the downside. You may not see that move 80 to 90 percent of the time. Rather, you wait for the market to make a little move all the way to the downside. And if you see a breakout, it means that market is going to continue all the way to the upside. And that is what you should be focusing on right now. In as much as retracement have a lot to do with the market because once you see retracement in the market, it means that the market have relaxed for the next move all the way to the upside. What you should be paying attention to right now on the one day chart BTC USDT is for the market to move a little bit upward and then little retracement and then continuation to $100,000 level because that is what I am expecting before the end of this year. Bitcoin have to hit this very target of $100,000 right here on this very price chart and this is what you should keep your eye on as well if you look at the stochastic rsi indicator for btc it is called that the market is already at overbought condition like i said market can stay in this overbought condition for a very long period of time remember the stochastic rsi indicator is a momentum indicator it does not show you market direction or trend direction what it does it just tell you where momentum is going comparing bulls and bears and this is what you must have to pay attention to right now so even though market is at over bought condition right now don't expect the market to just crash back down for the bears to take control of the market market have capacity of still moving upward in my own opinion for btc usdt one day chart and if you look at the macd indicator you discover that there is a whole lot of momentum on the macd histogram if you look at the macd line and the signal line right here you discover that there is a big dilation between the blue line and the orange line which mean market have high capacity of still moving all the way to the upside these are key things you must pay attention to on these different indicators in as much as retracement is going to come in no doubt but when that retracement comes in, don't take a short position on features because market is going to, be able to pump all the way to the upside. For our chart BTC USDT, because we are seeing a very little divergence right here, which can make that very um, bearish move to happen just little. If you look at this very point, you see a very little divergence from this very point right here to this very area. And uh, if you look at the indicator, which is the MACD indicator from this very point to this very area, it is covered that this is a bearish divergence, which means market have capacity of coming back down a little bit. And I'm expecting this retracement to come in from where the market is right now. And within this level of $94,000 for Bitcoin, in this very area of $90,000, a market can come all the way a little bit downward to this very area of $86,000 and $85,000, not crossing this very level of support, and the market will begin to move all the way to the upside as well. This is what I am personally looking at right now on this very price chart. So this very bearish divergence is going to make the market go, go down a little bit for retracement on the 4 hour chart before the next move upward. The pepper is still going to move all the way to the upside, especially in the heat of the bull run in 2025. Please consider supporting this channel by leaving a like for this video, subscribe, and turn on the bell notification for more crypto videos like this one. Also, check the channel for all that crypto content. Don't forget to join our Telegram channel with the link in the description and also in the pinned comment. Thanks for watching.